Looking at the Saad, there's a big buzz over the external affairs minister. As Jay Shankar has spoken exclusively to India today, Congress is held back at external affairs ministers. Nehru retort, Congress says Modi government still follows Nehru, India following non-aligned movement. As Jay Shankar had said that he had served the country, not a family. Congress says that essentially Nehru's policies are still being followed by this particular government as well. On the accusation of dancing around Nehruvians uh, for plum posting, Jairam also, uh, in fact, Jay Shankar also said that I don't work for a family and I have earned my post by, you know, clearing an exam. So the, those who work for a family shouldn't advise others. Uh, in fact, they, taking a dig at Jairam Ramesh. Well, uh, the current MEA is still following the Nehruvian principles of foreign policy, which is to be focused on the global south. And, 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 and which believes in the democracy of world powers. That there is no one single major world power that should lead the world. The world should be democratized and power should be decentralized. So it's funny that how uh, the current foreign minister, while still following the principles and approach laid down by India's first prime minister, and ends up criticizing uh, Pandit Nehru and his legacy, it is thanks to Pandit Nehru's legacy and approach towards non-alignment is how India has been today managing its relationship both with Russia and the United States successfully. Now he's in politics. He should realize now you are in a political party. You belong to a political party. So in political party you are vulnerable for all sorts of allegations and accusations. So wherever any political issue will arise, opposition will definitely target at you. As BJP leaders do, BJP is Congress. So I think he should not have also brought this family issue in the picture because BJP is also into dynastic politics. Look at the states, all many, you know, their leaders, their family members are in politics. So I think again saying family, family, family and everything, Gandhi family is not right on this part also. Congress MP Pramod Tiwari is joining us, senior leader. Ms. Tiwari, uh, S.J. Shankar in an exclusive conversation to India today says that whether Nawaz Sharif comes or any other leader comes, Pakistan really has to rethink and do a reset of its thinking and stop terrorism for any talks or peace process to continue. Look, in को तजवी नहीं देंगे किसी भी राष्ट्र में आतंकवादी गतिविधियां दूसरे राष्ट्र के प्रति पर पाकिस्तान लगातार में उल्लंघन कर रहा है हम नवाज शरीफ को आप कैसे समझते हैं क्या हम भूल जाएं जो वक्त कारगिल क्या हम भूल जाएं इनका पिछला कार्यकाल आतंकवाद बहुत ऐसे को जो रहा है नहीं सवाल सिर्फ ये है आए कोई जाए कोई एक काम होना चाहिए कि पाकिस्तान को जिसने आतंकवाद की नर्सरी बना रखा है उसे उसे समाप्त